Hello and welcome back to another episode of our How To Use series. So today, today we are covering Jinx. Now I have two sets for you and I'm going to jump straight in on them. So with this Jinx we have a Leftovers and Dry Skin. So Dry Skin, basically if a water type attack hits you, you heal. Uh, but and but they're, they're a quarter of your health and if you hit by rain, that's an eighth of your health. So it can be really handy if you have a Drizzle one as well, for example Pelipper. And But if there's Sun or Fire, you're going to get hurt a little bit more. Um, yeah, so you're not really going to want to take a fire attack anyway, so it's not the worst thing in the world. And the other, the others like Oblivious, um, not really very good as such, and Forewarn can be handy, but not really necessarily. So we have Calm Mind here, Psychic, Ice Beam, and Signal Beam. So Calm Mind just to get your special attack up and special defense up as well. And then we have Psychic for your stab, Ice Beam is also stab, and then Signal Beam is just a bit more coverage just to to deal with those dark types that might be incredibly annoying. And then for EVs, we have max HP and max special attack with a modest nature, so more special attack and less attack, you're not using that attack stat at all. And then we have four in special defense. So I think it's pretty simple how to use the set. You can't mind out once or twice if you can, then you psychic, ice beam, signal beam, depending on what you need to do. Leftovers gets your health back. You can change it on all type moves and that can help. But yeah, that is the first Jinx. So the second Jinx we have is a Light Clay Jinx with Aurora Veil. So this is a little bit little bit different. So Light Clay does actually affect Aurora Veil. I did have to look it up. I did have to look it up, I think. Actually, I think it says here. It says here, yeah, Aurora Veil. So hold it. Uh, I'll put Oblivious here. You can use Dry Skin again. I would say Dry Skin or Forewarn, either of those. Uh, so you have Aurora Veil, Hail, uh, it obviously if you have snow, some with Snow Warning, then that just changes that up, but I've got Hail there as well, then Blizzard and Toxic, so having the Hail and the Blizzard together works really well, because obviously it'll hit 100% of the time, and then you get the Aurora Veil up, you get your special defense and defenses up, and Toxic is to just do some damage, uh, get that chip damage on there. And then this is a specially defensive set, so special defense is maxed as well as HP and then 4 in a, in a special attack and then you have a calm nature, so more in special defense and less in attack because again you're not using that attack stat at all. And that is all I have for Jinx today, so I hope you enjoyed this, if you have please do like, subscribe and comment. Let me know how you've used Jinx because I think there are multiple ways you can use it. Anyways, I'm out of here, so have a good one and I'll see you soon.